Hey, Jamie here from Videos, and in this video, I'm gonna take you inside videos and show you how easy it is to build a couple of different animations with the platform. So if you just follow me a second, I'm gonna head over to uh, my, uh, my PC here, and um, I'm gonna jump on. So first thing to mention here is, it's web-based, so it's all cloud, um, so you can access this from anywhere you are on Earth. All you need is an internet connection, nothing to download. So, first thing I'm gonna do is log in here. So I'm just gonna log in. Now, the first thing you're gonna see as soon as you log in are your videos. So every single video you create, every single animation, is all gonna be kept in here within your account at all times. So you can come in and download these whenever you need them. So what we're gonna do first is click on the Create tab here. And when we click on the Create tab, we're gonna come through to all of the different, um, different templates we can use to create our animation. Now, as you can see at the top, we've got lots of different variations you can use. So we've got the logo intros, we've got call to actions, we've got miscellaneous templates, which have loads of really cool stuff in, some outros, and we've also got social templates as well. So we've got different styles of animations you can create. Now, the one I'm gonna show you here is how easy it is to create an animated logo. So to take any logo you have and animate it within minutes within videos. So that's what we're gonna do. So we're on the logo stinger tab here. And as you can see, we've got lots of different templates in here and just by hovering your cursor over any of them, you can see how they all work. You can see the different style of the animation to essentially pick the one you want to use. Now, I'm gonna choose this one down here. So all you need to do is click on Create. And once we come through here, we've got a few little things we need to fill in. So the first thing is to name your animation. So I'm just gonna name this your logo for this example. We're then gonna choose the logo you actually want to animate. So in this case, I'm just gonna grab the, uh, the logo here. So I'm just gonna gra grab the video's logo. We then move on to the colors section, which allows us to choose a color. And then once we've done that, we click on finish. Now, once we click on finish here, we then choose, uh, or we then look at all of the different things we've popped in. So the name of the logo, we've got the video's uh, logo we're gonna animate, and we just then click on build video. So once we click on build video, we then go through to a screen, your video is baking. So what's happening now is videos has gone to work for you. That's all you need to do. The videos is now going to fully render that animation for you. And once it's fully rendered, it's going to appear in the my video section um, that we saw earlier. So I'm gonna go over to that now. And as you can see on screen here now, it's rendering live. So it's gonna go through to 100%. Now this can take a few minutes depending on how big the animation is, what you're trying to animate. But as you can see on screen here, it's working really fast and doing all of the work for you. Okay, so we're 100% done now. That logo has been animated, so let's check it out. So we head back over to my movies or my videos, and we see it up at the top here. So all we need to do is literally download. Okay, so that's downloaded. Now let's check it out. As we can see, we now have a fully animated logo. That's how easy it is to create a logo animation um, from scratch with a few clicks that anybody can do. Now, videos isn't just about logo animation. In fact, videos is also about animating other types of outros, intros, and what I wanna do now is show you um, an animation uh, or create an animation for an outro as well. We all know how important outros are for your videos and call to action, so let's check out how easy those are to create in videos as well. So we click on the Create tab again, and this time when we come through to this screen, we're gonna head over to Outros, and I'm gonna choose to create this one here. And all we do is name the outro. So I'm just gonna name this new outro. And we head over to text. So this is gonna allow us to put any text into this animation that we want. So in this one, I'm going to put like my video. We go, I'm gonna put subscribe below now. And then the last one, let's put a nice little thank you. I've got all of those in, I'm happy with those. Um, move through to the colors section. Yep, happy with that. Click finish. Um, again, you're gonna get a confirmation on screen of all the text you've put in, so you can just check your spelling, make sure you've no spell errors. Um, move over to build video. 
and again our video is baking so videos is going to work again this time it's going to create an animated text outro for use at the end of your videos to help with the increase in subscribers call to actions and whatever you want to use it for so once it's finished rendering the actual animation as it's just done now we can simply download it and check it out so let's download it and let's check it out here so here we go as we can see, we've got an awesome little outro animation here. There's our first text. Going through to our next text now. Subscribe below now. And then lastly, just to keep things really polite, we've got a nice little thank you. So that's how easy it is to animate anything inside videos, outros, intros, logo stingers, logo reveals, um, miscellaneous stuff, we've got social stuff in there as well. But as you can see, this is built for absolutely anyone to use, regardless of your technical ability right now. It's all built in the cloud, you just log in, click a few buttons, put your text, put whatever you want to animate in there, and videos does the work for you.